Hello everyone, do you like the video? Now I will show you step by step on how to do your own height measurement. Let's get started! First of all, take one male to male jumper wire and pin it to 5B. The other end of the wire, pin it to the breadboard like this. Then, take a male female jumper wire, which is look like this, and pin the sharp part and align with the wire. And the blunt end of the jumper wire connect to the VCC of the sensor. Make sure the both wires are in a straight line. Next, with the same step, connect pin number 13 to trick, pin number 12 to echo, and lastly, GND to GND of the sensor. Once you are done, you can put the sensor on a high place like your cupboard or you can put it on your table. So now I will put the sensor on the table like this. Oh, if you are too short to climb your cupboard, you can put it on your table like mine here. Okay, so put the sensor here and we need a tab. So put, take a tab and you put it like this. So when you are done, sense a little So now we proceed to the program part. Okay, so first of all, you need to open your envelope file. First of all, we need to have our Arduino Uno as our device. Okay, click this add button and then go look for Arduino Uno. So I have Arduino Uno here. Then click OK. Okay, so now we have Arduino Uno as our device. Now we want to connect our serial port. Make sure the mode mod switch is upload yeah. so now we're gonna connect the USB cable to your computer make sure you have the red light so press this connect button Click show all connectable devices and click connect. So now our serial port is connected. So let's move on to the coding part of our device. Okay. So first of all, go to event, get up, and put it here. Next is forever bug block. Take this one and drag it out. We use forever block because we want to have the reading of the sensor at continuously. Now we're gonna add extension to our device. So we add upload mode broadcast. So by adding this extension, we can enable our device to interact with the sprite. Okay, so we add the upload mode broadcast. Okay, so now we want our device to send message to our sprite later on with the 
reading of the sensor. So now we include the reading of the sensor. Before that, remember we put our trick pin to pin number 13 and then our echo to pin number 12. Change the pin number here and then put it inside here. Okay, so now our code for our device is complete. So now let's upload it to our device. So you upload the code into your device, then we move on to our sprite. So here I'm using a panda, a very cute panda. Okay, so here we need to maximize the screen so that we can see the value clearly later on. Okay, now we need a button, a start button. So click and drag this one. And then take this one, wait for one second. Then we need a new variable here, yeah. So make a variable. This one will be our reference. So we need the value of the things that on the the value the height from your sensor and the ground. Okay. Now we need to use the extension. So we add on a new extension here, just like your device just now. So we need upload, upload mod broadcast. Okay, so we click add here. Okay, then we click upload mod broadcast. Then click drag out this one upload mode message value so the value which is the reading from the sensor will be sent into your sprite okay then once it's uh, once it's measured the reference okay the height the height of your sensor to your ground which is which is our reference value okay we need something to notify us so let's start here okay so put a sound start sound if you don't like meow sound here you can choose any sounds you sound here okay then you go add sound uh, you can choose any sounds you like here Okay, we have a new sound here. So we go back to our sprite. Okay, so now we click oh, I don't want meow. So I choose referee whistle. Once our device have measured our refer value, then we make a sound. Now we want our sensor to measure the height. Okay, so we need wait for one second. We put it here so that it gives some time for us to put our thing underneath the sensor later on. Yeah, okay. So we want it to be forever ongoing process. Right now, take a new variable here, click make a variable, then name your new variable as D. Take set distance and then take this one, go to upload mode, then drag this one out. So now after our sensor have measured the reference value, now it will measure the distance. Let us make a new variable again. Click on make a variable and name it as height. Click OK. So now we want to set our height. So now we have some mathematics to do. So we go to operator, grab the minus block here and put it inside. 
Okay. Okay. Uh, remember to change the D here. Ah, huh? we don't want the D. We want it to be our height. So the height will be our reference value minus by. Oh no. Okay, put it inside. Make sure you put it in the right box. Yeah. Huh? Okay, and then minus by our distance value. Okay, and then we want our panda to say the height of the object. So go to look. Hi, panda to say out the height. Okay, let's try it out. Let's start. Okay, so now once you hear the whistle you can put your things underneath for example here i will put my chair the height of my chair is 41 centimeter so that's how you build your own height measurement hope you like it thank you bye bye